go too close. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. As you can see from the title of this video, this is going to be a baby spring clothing haul. I'm filming this video later than I normally film videos. You can probably see my phone charging over here. It's 6.40. I Filming this video is on like my nice to-do list. Every day I have like a have to do, nice to do, and hold off on. Filming today was all my nice to do. At first I was like, ah, oh, I won't do it today. And then I was like, you know what? I will do it today during Jude's last nap. But then when I transferred her to the crib, she woke up. So then she ended up napping on me. Um, and yeah, now it's 6.40 and I'm filming this video. So let's just get to the haul. I have items from H&M. And if you saw my, what did I call it? A few days in the life of a stay at home mom vlog video. You saw that I did a little sneak peek of these clothes. I ordered most of them online and then a few items I did get in store. I will try to link below any of the items I can find. If you are shopping at H&M, I would always recommend to shop online, especially for baby clothes. For some reason in store, I just feel like their baby clothes are lacking, especially like the cute things. I don't know. Oh yeah, so this is going to be a baby girl clothing haul, but a lot of these pieces are gender neutral. Um, so don't click off if you have a baby boy and you're like, oh, not for me. I think you'll actually be pleasantly surprised. Since I said that, let's start with something that's gender neutral. I have this little brown overall, has this little pocket in the front. Obviously a baby's not gonna use a pocket, but I think it's super cute. I got this in size six to nine. Oh wait, I got this in size nine months because I do want this to fit Jude throughout the summer and she is a very tall baby she's in like the 99th percentile for height and then her weight i think is in like the 65 percentile um so nine months should be fine let me zoom out all right hopefully that's yeah much better so yeah this is the first piece i think it's super cute great for layering which kind of goes into the next pieces i'll share so i got this set let me separate it out I got these sets of onesies. I got these in, I believe nine months too. Yeah, I got these in nine months too. They look quite big. These actually might be too big for Jude right now, but I, I'm fine with putting her in oversized stuff. So it came in this set of four onesies. You have this like taupe, very light brown color, a gray, a tan, a light tan, I would say, and then like a darker tan. I like gender neutral and neutral colors. So you're gonna see a lot of that in this haul. And then I thought these would be nice for spring and summer because right now all of those just like plain layering onesies I have for Jude are actually long sleeves. And obviously as it gets warmer, she doesn't need to be wearing long sleeves and you don't want your baby to be overheated. The next piece that I got, I think it was labeled as for boys. Um, but I I don't care. If I see something that I think is cute, I will put Jude in it. Um, is this little dinosaur set so cutie? So I actually got the top in six months and I think it looks pretty big. Then I got the pants in nine months. Most baby clothes, when it has a tie like this, it doesn't actually like tighten. Jude has a smaller waist, but like very chubby, cutie thighs, similar to her mom. And so I love that I'm going to be able to tighten on her waist, but she'll still have like room on her um, legs. I, I was gonna use this for PJs, but honestly, I think I'll just put it, her in it for like a comfy weekend outfit. I think it's so cute. Look how cute that is. Adorable. And she loves dinosaurs. If you see it in my other videos, I've definitely mentioned that. You've seen dinosaurs here and there throughout the videos. The next piece I thought would be great for her, I got this in nine months, are just these little brown shorts. Again, very neutral item, very plain, but just nice to have because you can pair it with any of those onesies. I could, you can even actually pair it with this dinosaur, di dinosaur top. Um, that matches well. And then it actually matches also with the next two things I got, which I had to do it. I had to get the character items. These are two Lion King tops. They come in the set of two and I got them in nine month size. When I was little, I had little Lion King PJs. So when I saw these, I was like, I'm gonna have to get them 
and I'll probably have to do like a shot of me in the PJs and a shot of Jude in the PJs and compare. But I just think these are so cute. And again, it's nice that you can mix and match them. Oh, I'm sorry. The set of onesies came in a set of five. It also came with these, this white, plain white one. So great deal. The next thing I got, a little bit different, and this actually has a price in it, so I'll share. So I must have gotten this um, in store. This was $13 for a set of two little sun hats. And I got these in size three to six months. This is the one that fit Jude. I don't know her head to conference percentile, but we did just get back from her six month appointment. And I think, I, I think her head was either th uh, 43 or 44 centimeters. I don't remember exactly. I don't really keep track of her head measurements, honestly, because like, they'll tell me something's wrong so these came in these little two little packs so this striped green sun hat and then this like just sage green sun hat so cute especially for babies it's really important to be protecting their skin so as we go on into the summer i want to be taking jude to the beach and to the park more and right now when we're outside she's most of the time in her stroller like if we're going for a walk which has a huge sunshade over her so when she's not i want to be able to put her in these little hats and they do have a tie at the bottom so they don't just fly off in the wind or get lost because if you don't know baby items get lost i think like 90 percent of this haul is gender neutral the next thing i got which you might be like is that for spring and summer i think so um i got this in size nine months so these are two long sleeves top they come in a set of two so you have this like just tan color and it has the buttons it's like a henley type thing um i'll try and zoom in so you can see it and then it comes also with the striped one that just has a little pocket great for layering once again i do think it's nice to have a few long sleeves especially for the spring maybe not for the summer but at least where i live in the dc area sometimes in the spring it gets a little chillier like today it was in the high 80s like the high was in the high 80s and i'm still wearing long sleeves these are both light like i guess you could wear them in the winter but i don't think they would keep it being warm enough so i consider them more like a spring maybe early summer layering piece the next piece i got is this little linen t linen i like that name this little linen two-piece set i think it's not focusing well on the color but it is this very light tan beige color it comes with this top and the shorts the reason i got this the main reason i got it is if you've heard of the company lullaby club which i think i've shared in multiple hauls on my YouTube channel. I love the Little Bike Club and they actually do have sets for little babies, but I think the smallest size they have is one year. So that would not fit Jude, but I want her to be able to match me. And I have like, how many? Either two or three of these linen lounge sets. And so I said, Jude needs one too, because I love matching with her. A few more items, I would say these are more of the things that you might just want to put in the baby girls i personally would put any baby in anything this is the one that i previewed in my uh few days in a life stay at home mom vlog it is this little terry cloth romper i think this is the cutest thing ever you might be looking at this and being like nicole that is quite plain what is special about that if you like just like plain laid back clothing i feel like you're going to also love this it is this like yeah terry cloth towel material it just it's like peachy beige color this is the color that i love 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 on jude it's so soft perfect for spring because it is like a tiny bit thick but then obviously it's still short sleeves and honestly for a baby even in the summer i think this would work because most babies um are going to be a little bit colder than you are so yeah i think this is so cute especially if like we're coming back from swim class this is perfect for her i love this this is probably my favorite piece and then my second favorite piece uh, in this um haul i like all the pieces obviously but i guess we're an ending with my favorite ones so it's this little long sleeve and dress so sweet i'm gonna have to probably take one of jude's like monthly photos in this so I got this in size nine months. I think I stopped saying what sizes I got things in, but most of the things I got are in size nine months, some are in size six months, mostly because again, I want this to carry out through spring and like going into summer and be able to fit Jude. H&M sizes do run a tiny bit big. So honestly, 
like for example this is nine months and i feel like this could probably fit her close to when she's one years old she might outgrow it just height wise because she's a very tall girl as i mentioned but i'm not sure we'll see i think this is so cute i love florals as you can see as soon as we enter like warmer weather all of a sudden i just love florals so i got this and i think it is so so cute you could also just take this and have it with one of the short sleeves onesies if it's too hot outside for long sleeves because this long sleeve is thicker you could also just do the long sleeves with shorts i don't know you're really getting your bang for your buck with these two-piece sets last thing that i physically have to show you here is this cutie bathing suit so it has a few ruffles i'm not a huge ruffle fan for baby clothes but if it's like a little bit ruffly like this i think that's adorable and then it's blue and white striped as you can see jude is in swim classes if you've seen a few of my other vlogs right now she only has one bathing suit because i had a really hard time finding any other ones for her so i wanted her to have one more and that's everything that I have to show you physically here. The last two things I got are in the laundry and I'm not gonna grab them. So one is this little two-piece pink set that Jude wore actually for her baby dedication. I thought it was perfect for the baby dedication. Our church is more like casual, but I also still wanted her to look dressed up and nice since it was a special occasion. I thought it gave very much spring vibes, Easter vibes, since Easter is upcoming. It was last weekend, Easter's this weekend. And yeah, I absolutely loved it. And then the last thing I got, which I took Jude's six month photos in, that video will actually be coming next week. So you'll see this video on Thursday or Friday. Next week you'll see Jude's six month update video. So I took her photos in that and I also think it's really cute. I have a dress that matches it kind of. So I have a black and white daisy dress. Then I saw this one that was yellow and white daisies and I thought, perfect we can match and it i'm gonna pop up a picture it's only the dress this is not coming a two pack i just put the long sleeves onesie that we already had underneath just to keep her a little bit warmer because it was not super warm that day but and as we get into the warmer months i would just have her wear the dress alone or again if it's a colder day put one of these pieces underneath so that is everything i'm not going to take jude in and out of these clothes like i would do for my own clothing haul because that seems really excessive and she also hates 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 getting dressed so i'm not putting her through that for this video you can probably imagine what they're going to look like she's crying upstairs she's with Corey though um but i'm about to go up because i don't like what i hear her crying and i'm just she's just upset i will try to link as many down below as i said so i hope this video is helpful even if you don't have a baby looking at baby clothes are so cute like who doesn't like looking at baby clothes i love looking at baby clothes before i had a baby now i love 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 looking at baby clothes um i hope you found this video helpful and i hope you're drinking out with me bye